Hey, 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 we're Snap, this is Dwarmer the Great. Welcome back to an exciting episode of Pokemon Showdown, Little Cub Battles. Today, we are doing a fun little team that I built a long time ago. In fact, these battles are from a long time ago, and some of you guys have spoiled them for yourselves, looking at you, Scad and Nougat, but um, I, we were talking about this a lot in the Discord, and I promised I would put this up for you guys. It turns out I didn't actually record the episodes, but I had, I had saved the replay links. This is a little, look, a little Little Cup team that I built a while ago um, that is using the starters of many of your guys' teams uh, from the Gray version. If you guys remember, uh, last year at some point we did a, the Pokemon Showdown Gray version. Uh, might have even leached into this year a little bit. It was a pretty long-running series. In fact, I'm certain it probably did because that was a really long-running series. Anyway, but you guys uh, were act as the trainers that we battled in that series, and many of you were in the rival weeks, would put together a team, and you carried your starter through the series just like I had to carry my starter through the series. If you guys haven't watched that series, go through and check it out. But I decided to make a team with all of your guys' starters in it, um, and this was just a quick little battle I threw together. I... I don't know why I saved a battle against a three Pokemon team, but okay. Uh, I don't have time at this point with Pokemon Sun coming out and things like that and the Thanksgiving holiday coming up, all that, to record new footage. So we're going to go with the footage I already saved, uh, and let's check out what battle number two has in store. I'm pretty sure it's up against a full team, so let's see how it goes. Here we go. Alrighty guys, here we go up against Spiffy Tiffy, and we've got Badoo leading off against Smoggy. I believe that Badoo was Nurion's starter, um, and then we've got uh, Charmu, which was Nougat, Chubbs, which was Mac, Yuri, which was Scad, Kipper Flipper. I meant to look up who Kipper Flipper belonged to. I wanted to say Codeman, but I honestly can't remember, and then Jonathan Davis is uh, is the Art Inke, and that is Ecat's starter. Um, Kipper Flipper goes down to a Solar Beam from Ponystar there. Charmu's gonna come in and throw up the rocks there. We already got a couple of sets of spikes going. So we've got that going pretty well. Charmu gonna finish up the Ponyta. Then Smoggy's gonna switch in and take a Dazzling Gleam, uh, uh or throw a Dazzling Gleam up at Charmu. Charmu gonna be able to finish off with a Dragon Claw there. Uh, Patrick then gonna switch in, taking some damage from the rocks and everything like that. Another Dazzling Gleam coming and finishing off the Charmu. At which point, Yuri's gonna switch in. See, Nougat, there was a battle with Yuri. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Uh, and Yuri's gonna use the energy ball and finish off Patrick. At which point, Spoon's gonna switch in. Yuri's gonna switch out. Badoog back in, taking that shadow sneak there. Badoog gonna throw up another round of spikes because the star U was able to rapid spin those off. So we're gonna get at least the spikes back up. Um, and then Badoog gonna go down. At which point, Jonathan Davis comes in, uses that knockoff, gets rid of the Eevee Light from Spoon. Spoon gonna set up the sword dance, um, and then Jonathan Davies gonna use the knockoff again, finishing off the uh, Hone Edge there. Dr. Eggman then gonna switch in, Jonathan Davies gonna use the knockoff there, doing a little damage to himself, but getting some good work going, getting rid of that Focus Sash, which obviously wouldn't have come into play if it was more than a one-shot move anyway, but uh, that's alright, Jonathan Davies doing good work there. Um, able to finish off here finally with a third knockoff there, finishing off Dr. Eggman. Jonathan Davies taking some toxic damage though as Shocking switches in. Probably, yep, I decided to just leave Jonathan Davies in, get the knockoff going. Didn't expect the one shot, but I figured I might as well leave him in to, to get rid of that item before we move on. And that's exactly what happened, except for that that's not what happened. We managed to one shot the Voltorb. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing some of your starters uh, in action here. Um, should have the final episode of the Pokemon Showdown Little Cup Tournament coming out next week, so keep an eye out for that, the exciting finale of Nougat versus Pablo K. Sanchez. See how that uh, the finale turns out and who ends up being the victor of the tournament. Check in then for those battles uh, next week at some point. Um, and, and then maybe, you know, it's not going to happen in the remainder of this year, but maybe um, as we're, we've had a lot of talk of Grey version going on, maybe sometime early next year, we should talk about how we want to go ahead and get in Grey version Season 2 going, because I know a lot of you guys enjoyed that very much. I did as well, um, and uh, this little uh, playing around with you guys as starters here uh, just uh, kind of uh, reiterates that. Want to want to get this going again at some point. Again, not going to be this year, but once we get this tournament uh, finished, holiday season come and gone, uh, we'll start talking about it again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Tournament the Great, and you guys have been great. Have a good one.